Hello and welcome, my name's Ryan, I'm also known as RM2K Dev. Um, welcome to this video. This is just going to be a update about what's going on, where I've been, uh, how I'm doing, what I'm up to, and what's going to be coming in the future as well. Um, pretty much just a standard update video. Anyway, so first thing I want to tell you guys about is a RPG Maker giveaway. So I'm celebrating 17,000 subscribers. Thank you all for subscribing. That is absolutely a ridiculously huge number. I actually never thought I'd probably get this far on YouTube. Um, I'm also celebrating our first million views. So yes, that is absolutely insane i can't believe that we've had a million views since i started this channel last year um well actually i started the channel a lot earlier than that but i really started focusing on tutorials for game development probably last this time last year so we've had a million views in one year that is absolutely insane uh so thank you guys all so much for that and to celebrate that i'm giving away two copies of rpg maker vx ace and also two copies of uh, Game Character Hub. Now I'll leave a link in the description. I've got a post about this on my blog of how you can enter this um, giveaway. And yes, yeah, so I'll leave a link to the description of that in the, sorry, I'll leave a link to the blog post on that in the description of this video. The second announcement I have for my channel RM2K Dev is the introduction of Unity 3D tutorials. So I used to use Unity before I was using Game Maker and I used it a lot more than I used Game Maker, mainly because my normal nine to five job, I, I was a C-sharp developer at the time and it made sense for me to be developing games in C-sharp. Uh, then I moved to more towards a Node.js based role where now I work with, you know, AngularJS and things like that. But I still dabble in C++, C++, C Sharp um, all the time. So I figured we would start um, moving towards some Unity 3D tutorials. And they've got some amazing features over there. I've been playing with it recently, getting familiar with the user interface again and updated features and things like that. And all I can say is I've just been blown away at the features one of the main reasons that I've been thinking of moving towards Unity tutorials recently is just because for as good as Game Maker is at doing two-dimensional games and, um, you know, platformers, role-playing games, things like that, it sometimes has a couple of drawbacks. And I've personally noticed if I'm working on a large project and they update it and then my version auto updates, I'll often open my project up and some script or function that I was using will now be broken. Um, so there are a couple of drawbacks to using Game Maker, but with that said, in a realistic production environment, you shouldn't be updating the software as it as, ver as new versions come out to stay with the latest, the latest release, you really probably want to pick a version and stay with that so that you know when you completed it and all the bugs are fixed, that you won't have any new introduced bugs from from the developers of that uh, that platform. Uh, the next thing I wanted to talk about is a relatively new idea that I had. Um, this is going to be called Screenshot Saturday. Sh Screenshot Saturday. No, Screenshot Saturday standouts. Um, every Sunday, I'm going to be posting my personal picks for the Screenshot Saturday. So I, I go through Screenshot Saturday on oh, Screenshot Saturday. Screenshot Shatter Day. I can't say that. It's uh, it's like a tongue twister. So I go through Screenshot Saturday every uh, every weekend. Every Saturday I watch these coming in on my Twitter feed. And there's some amazing games out there that uh, are currently up and coming. And people are posting, you know, images and videos of them to their Twitter feeds all day. And I think there's a website as well called ScreenshotSaturday.com, which aggregates all of those. Anyway, I'm going through those and and I'm picking out some that I feel are standouts, some that are really good quality. They look like they're coming along well. And I figured I would make a blog post and share them. So that is my idea with these Screenshot Saturday shout standouts. They're basically games that I think are looking well and coming along well, and I thought that I would leave a reference to them on my blog post so that hopefully you guys can see them and hopefully go on favorite and retweet their tweets and then help other people grow their own games and projects and things like that. The next announcement is I will be working on a better upload schedule. So once I've finished doing a couple of Unity 3D tutorials, I haven't got anything set in stone yet, but I will be basically looking towards producing content more frequently and on a dedicated schedule. So it'll probably be something like every every Monday and every Thursday to begin with, and then we'll increase that 
maybe Monday, Wednesday and Saturday or Monday, Wednesday, Friday, things like that. So it'll probably be something along the lines of like on Monday, because I know everyone's going back to work, I'll probably be uploading my gameplay videos. Um, on Wednesday, I'll probably upload a video. It could either be a tutorial or it would probably be a a video of my progress on my games and things like that. So it'd be like Monday is RM2K Dev Gaming Day. Wednesday would be RM2K Dev Update Day, potentially tutorial day. And Friday would be a proper tutorial day because that's the beginning of the weekend. And hopefully everyone has enough time to go and watch the tutorial and uh, follow through with that. And this is something I've been thinking about. I, I get a lot of requests to separate the gaming uh, the cooking and the tutorials into different YouTube channels. The main reason why I haven't done that yet is just simply because I don't have the time to maintain three YouTube channel channels. I, I, I do work from like 7 a.m. till about 6 p.m. every day and I do this in my spare time so I really don't have the time to go and moderate, um, remove a lot of the poison that some people on YouTube leave um, in the comment section and, and take care of three different channels. That's why RM2K Dev at the moment is just a bit of everything. Um, and some people like that. I think a lot of I think a lot of my viewers actually enjoy that, but some of them don't enjoy that. So I've got the blog set up now in a way that I'll have everything organized into different sections. Uh, there's sections for food, there's sections for gaming, there's sections for Unity and Game Maker, and I'll be uploading the videos there as well. So if you're looking for a better way to uh, find my content and have it organized for you, so you don't just have to have like a flood of RM2K devs random videos in your subscriber list, then you can go and check out the blog. That's www.rm2kdev.net, and there will be a much better organized system over here for you. Um, so yeah, with that said, uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this video and keep your eyes out because probably either today, tomorrow or the day after, there will be the first Unity video. Um, so yeah, please uh, leave a like on this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye for now.